What is up y'all? So today I'm going to teach y'all how to get this hair. Um, it's pretty simple, a few steps, uh, nothing too hard. I y'all for the support on this channel um i can't believe i actually grew a youtube channel like that's just like a really cool thing to me it's like my dream to be a youtuber i used to create more videos before i used to create videos like every single day and it just never blew up and like now i'm just like i'm doing this for fun and it's just cool to me hey y'all uh, sebastian also known as little seabass today i'm gonna teach y'all how to do this hair pretty simple um it just takes a few steps um it's kind of like um i don't know how to explain I don't know how to explain my hair. Um, it's super fluffy, nothing too crazy. It's kind of low profile. It like points out, it shoots everywhere. You know, it's not like crazy. Uh, I think it's a really good hairstyle. I do need a haircut soon. But yeah, so that's what we're gonna do today. I'm gonna cut to a clip of me before my hair and I'll show you all what it looks like. This is my hair right now. It's kind of just like everywhere. This is how it is whenever I get out of the shower. I don't use any like special products. I usually use Celsin Blue, but I'm kind of out of it, so. I, you, right, lately I've been using Suave, 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 whatever that is. But yeah, that doesn't really make a difference. Any conditioner or shampoo will work for you. There's nothing special on that side. But what does really come down to it is the hairspray. But I'm gonna get into that um, later in the video. But if y'all wanna drop like a like and subscribe, and I'll keep y'all updated with more videos to come as long as you hit the little bell button. Um, yeah, we're gonna get into it. My hairspray. So the thing is about the hairspray, um, you need a really light hairspray. I tried using, for about one day, I tried using this stuff. It says just a flexible hold, but it's really, um, really hard hold. It's not, even if it says it's flexible, but I have this stuff, it's pretty expensive. It's about $34.99 or $30.39. I'm gonna look that up. It says its retail price is 44, uh, VIP uh, $37, $37. It really comes up to like 40 bucks. But yeah, so this is like the best hairspray I've come across. Monte Studio One, refinishing control hairspray. Uh, refinish control hairspray for light and medium hold. So if y'all want this hairspray, just go in the link in the description. It's actually my stepmom's site and like, down there you can find the hairspray. Also sign up for a VIP membership. Um, so that gives you 15% off, free shipping on any orders. But the link is in the description for the hairspray. And I'm just saying this hairspray is probably the best hairspray I've ever had. This is not a paid sponsorship or anything like that. I'm just saying it from personal opinion. I've used like probably like 10 hairsprays, 10 plus hairsprays. And this is the best one I've found. It's not hard. It's super like, I could just mess with it all day. It stays, it holds, and gives you that look that you're looking for. So we're gonna get back to the video. So that's what I use, and I don't use too much, so it usually lasts a long time. I know a lot of people like dry their hair a certain way. That's not how I usually do it. I don't use um, an air dryer, whatever, what's an air dryer? I literally just like walk around the house and wait till it dries. Cause I, 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 it makes my hair too fluffy. I have kind of like thin to medium hair. So I just ran out of this heat stuff that I usually spray on my hair and it keeps my hair from getting damaged, but I have pretty strong hair anyway. Okay, so the first thing you do is you wanna spray that heat stuff on there, um, you, mainly just in the front. You don't need to use that much. We're gonna be using a curling iron. This is probably the cheapest curling iron you could ever buy. This is just a small curling iron. So this is plugged in, so I don't wanna touch it. Um, <laughs> But I, I just use a curling iron because it's easier. And also I just get more of an effect that's like lower. I like to use a brush. Um, it just depends. I just literally go like this. I'm looking at my mirror right now. Um, but I just take, take a strand like this. I go down. I just roll it like a little bit at the end. I look weird. Um, I just roll like a little bit at the end, like that. So you just want it to come down to your eyebrows, and then it'll do all the effect for you once you just brush it out. Um, I'm just gonna do that usually like three times across, and that should be good. Don't leave it for too long, just keep it there for like a quick second, just run through it. Don't even leave it there, just run through it. So I'm just gonna do that to that side. Okay, just like that. And then if you want more volume, we can go like a row back. Um, I sometimes do this, I sometimes not do it. It just depends on like how my hair is throughout the day. See, it's already making like a difference. Um, so I'm doing another one. You really want that heat spray though, cause it's really, 
it's gonna make it more defined and it's gonna protect your hair, which you don't want bad hair. Um, but yeah, so you're just gonna, you're gonna mess with it like that. That's like the main thing. So you're gonna wanna roll. You're just gonna glide down with the curling iron. You wanna roll up, keep it there. And then you just keep it there for about one second. And that's about it. It's gonna put that heat on there. Now it's just gonna come down to the hairspray and styling. So right now, as you can see, my hair is kinda like, it's like fluffy, but it's not gonna stay there for the whole day. I'm gonna look weird doing this, but like, this is what I do. Um, I just fluff it up a little bit, get it to how I want it, and then just spray. That's really all you gotta do. You mess with it a little bit. So as you can see, it's already coming together. Um, I'll spray like a little bit more. And then what you wanna do is get under it. So let me show you. I'm using a little bit more than I usually would for this video. Um, but you just, you don't really want too much for like the video, but you don't want too much. As you can see, this is my hair. Uh, it's, for right now, it's good. Throughout the day, so in the end, this is what your hair is gonna look like. You got like different angles, this is from like below, this is from the side. So over the day, um, you'll see like your hair will get more fluffy. Um, usually within like the first like two hours, your hair will get more fluffy and you can brush it out. Just throughout the day, touch your hair a little bit, um, feel it and it'll just like naturally like brush out. What I'm pushing right now, is like getting a super thin hairspray. This stuff is the best hairspray I've ever found. But like, if you can get one of these, it's the best hairspray. So this is the hairspray I use again. Uh, Monte Studio One Ref... I'll show you guys. And I will put a link in, to, in the description with this and all my socials. So if y'all want to follow my socials, uh, I mainly do TikTok and Instagram, and now I'm trying to get my YouTube. But this is my hair tutorial. So whenever I do go in for a haircut, um, I usually just do trim on the sides, um, or I'll like do like a three on the sides, and then I'll just do a trim up top. That's what I usually do. Uh, it keeps the length good. A lot of people say it's like the Josh Richards hair. I don't really think it is. I think it's just a normal hairstyle. Um, it's just that he's a bigger influencer, so it kind of just turned into like his hair. So it's super fluffy, it stays, it holds for the whole day. Um, I really don't even need to worry about it unless it's super windy. Um, that's like the days I spray more hairspray. I'd say just like be careful, um, cause it can cause forehead acne. I don't have any luckily. Whenever you do have this haircut, wash your face every single morning and night because you can get like oil and dirt build up. It just happens when you have like floppy hair. Um, luckily I don't have any forehead acne, but I know a lot of people that do have this haircut and they get it. I'm just telling y'all a caution about this haircut. Um, or you guys can go shorter and it won't like really affect you as much, but it won't like cover your full head. Um, yeah, so that's my hair tutorial. So like the special announcement I have is I am dropping merch soon. Um, I don't know exactly when, but whenever I do, um, I'll keep y'all updated on all, all my socials. Um, everything will be updated. Um, hopefully, hopefully soon, but I know there's a lot of um, things going on in the world right now So I don't really want to be pushing out things that aren't really necessary Especially my own clothes, but I, th I thought it'd be pretty cool um, To drop some merch, so hopefully soon I'll let you all know um, I'll keep you all updated if y'all want to hit the hit the subscribe button like comment um, If y'all have any questions about the hair or anything like that I can fulfill those DM me on Instagram, comment in the comment section. I will be going through the comments, so. I know a lot of people wanted me to do this hair tutorial, so if y'all did enjoy it, just drop like a like and subscribe. I'm um, hopefully gonna come out with more videos, and then once I get a haircut, cause I don't really do anything with the sides or in the front, they just kinda like stay there, but, especially since I don't have a haircut. But once like my new video, once this new video comes out, I'm gonna have videos rolling behind this. So I just wanna say thank y'all. Everyone on here like really supports me. Uh, my YouTube is like you get to know me more and I don't really have that um, I think like TikTok and Instagram you guys just don't know me as well um, As like the people who are on my YouTube, so I just want to say thank you and I don't know I don't know how to do an outro Hope you all have a wonderful day. Stay safe out there. Stay home. It's like the main thing wash your hands um, I know if y'all need to reach out to me you can reach out to me stay safe and 
See you on the next video.